G'day and welcome back to our Lucky Russians campaign in CK2. So I was having a look at uh, this guy, Bajorus Lux. Um, he doesn't have any land, so I don't know how he became the guy. Um, he does have a strong claim on Kelmno, which is ours. Um, not sure if we'd ever actually be able to invite him to court without that. Um, I know we'd press our claims thing anyway. Opinion, Chief Golding. I mean, we can just give him the land. But then, not sure if that would just, yeah, I don't know. We'll leave it as it is for now. Alright, we have a new heir. Play as Princess Grimmislava. That's not good enough because we would lose the kingdom. So, inheritance. We nominate. Well, that's not good. We have to kill one of them. Although, no, we just have to vote for him. Chief the Brynja. Is not one of the options here. Is Fred Polk? No, he's the one that we're voting for. Right, um... Hmm. Really, need to get somebody else to vote our way. Or, more desperately, we have to kill somebody here. We kill him, or... It's Mr. Slav II and Gleb. Alright, um, Gleb has been an ongoing problem. This guy. His heir's in prison, got no chance. Can't really revoke anything from him there either. Uh, Mr. Slav. Might he Vladislav for us? Um, no, who was Mr. Slav? There's Gleb, Vladislav, Mr. Slav at Dorobetsky. This guy is voting the wrong way. Got a better chance of killing him. Um, let's just hope we don't die anytime soon. We are 49, so we may very well lose Russia here. Uh, we shall continue endeavouring to recruit this guy from Marienburg. There's one more little push. And our heir is unmarried. Alright, we could actually... well, don't really want to get her out of here. Um, let's go matrilineal, not to Volodar. Is there a genius? There is not. Is anybody quick? Nobody is. Um, in that case, if we do accidentally inherit her, we would probably want somebody who's good at intrigue. Uh, courtier in Russia. Alright, well, he wants to get married, but he's the wrong religion. Let's go Katia. Go for it. Alright, when I proceed to reveal the brand of my lower arm, certain that the final hook would sink in, Rafa inhaled sharply, worrying me for a second. You truly are called Dulden, he says, eager and relieved. Can you help me bring down my enemies? He promises. Write a letter to the coven about Rafa's induction. The Vidun that we're trying to kill will handle it from here. Alright, we've decided to accept High Chief of Estorgom. You accept a non-aggression pact. Um, right, he was one of the guys in the thing. That's all good. And Estegom is its own country at the moment. Could offer to join a war, but we can't form an alliance. Wasn't a close relative of his, probably. And yes, we're going to lose the Kingdom of Russia if we die. Hmm. That's nearly up to full. And... Gradislava, six years old. Alright, technological advance has got to be economic. Um, what do we actually need to get more out of Novgorod? Castle infrastructure, greater or equal to four. Improved keeps at four. Huh. Alright. Castle infrastructure needs to be here, so no. Barracks and training ground, or fortifications. I think we would want to go this way. That ahead penalty is huge, though. So, let's just boost the other infrastructures. Alright, cultural advances. You can do anything but noble cultures or legalism. Noble cultures, that ahead penalty is huge. Alright, um, no, we're not waiting for that. 
city vassal and temple vassal opinion, or I'll definitely need majesty. Military advance is the cavalry. Alright, looking pretty good. How is this in comparison to everything else? Yeah, not good compared to those sorts of places, but good for this whole region. On a whole, hell of a lot better. Alright, legalism map. We're actually top compared to the Far East. Alright, um, the one we're waiting to spread was the one for the castle walls. Yeah, improved keeps are nearly up a little. Castle infrastructure is past one there. Okay, so uh, we had to wait a bit until we could do Castle infrastructure at two. Oh yeah, that's going to take a very long time. All right, so it's only in there that we can really do much. Um, let's unpause it. Next thing we want to do then is probably stables or the Georgina. Thirty-five light cab. Complete his induction. Gain 200 dark power. Awesome. Um, heavy infantry with extra defense or just some light cav. I think we're going to go for the Dragina. And the betrothed may marry Princess Euphemia to Arpad Arpadfi. It's matrilineal. Um, yes, we want them to. The reasoning, I can't remember. This guy has a strong claim on the Empire of Magyar is the reason. Right, so was she the one? Euphemia. No, that's the one I thought was supposed to be there. Alright, whatever. All children shall be of her dynasty. Our parted Partfi has arrived. And our tribal vassal. Oh, awesome. He's adopted feudalism. Well, wow, that's just perfect. That gets rid of the malice for um, wrong government type. So old Vassal can only be gone pretty soon. Zealous versus Cynical isn't the best. Alright, now we definitely want to rank up. That will solve the problem that we weren't quite having here. The Intrigue is 60, ours is 60. Yeah, she's just as good as us. This should go up to 21. You hereby grant us the advance and a slightly better collar. Alright, um, what am I looking for? This one. Still only on 38%. It doesn't seem right. Fair enough. Must just always be like that because we can't invite him to our court or anything. Unable to press my claims. If we just gave it to him, though. Not sure how that would work. Um, I'm willing to just do it to find out. Now, it was Guy in Marienburg that we invited in. Alright, uh, wouldn't mind trying to recruit this guy. What do we want? 40 power. Chief Trojslav of Pomoria. His heir is under us anyway. Total loss in succession. Yes, right. Meeting with Chief Trojslav, but it doesn't work out. Now, Marienburg had bad inheritance as well. His heir is under her. Well, that's interesting. What happened to Iceland? How did that pop out in the middle? Hey, England's been formed. <laughs> oh, crap. 101%. Okay. Um, to give the council more power. We are certainly going to say no to this. We're going to try and fight her off on this one. And we're going to kill her at the same time. Forget about the other guy. Alright, uh, we will not be blackmailed. Thank you very much. Raise everything we have. Yeah, some of them have to come from way too far away. So, the Russian Civil War to increase council power on King Trophon. 
Oh, she's just in the north. That is excellent. There's a little bit down here. That's before she brings other people in, though. Alright, the white piece would be good for us. Alright, what happens if uh, we actually win? She would be imprisoned. Sviatoslava. Alright, any chance getting anybody good in here yet? Chief Dobrynia is the one we're voting for at the moment. Sviatopol. No, I think we'd want to just keep it like this. It's 14. Alright, so. Hopefully nobody else joins her. Called Chief of Novgorod Sversky in. That is him, that's fine. Training Grounds is finished. Training Grounds doesn't give us anything immediately, but... No, that was in uh, Luki, was it? Yes. Keep spending prestige. Alright, and I would count... Right, the Marshal went her way. Um, this guy would be a kick-ass Marshal. Don't think... be any loyalists. No. Alright, so just get the best marshal we can. And he is going to train troops there. Search for a smith, present debutant, etc, etc. Um, could just, you know what, let's get a commander. Rostislav is awesome. With leading the centre. Massive. Okay. Gain the minor, minor title command. I wonder who he steals it from. Oh, it's an empty one. Okay. Hell yes. Chief Pustachlov is still in there as well. Um, he is rather happy with us these days. So, anybody else that's going to kick off? This high chief cannot be allowed to do that. Okay. So, child lacking a focus. The bastard... It's an incapable bastard. Um, learn about the faith. Who was his parent? Our nephew. It's going to be the only one. That's going to be a dead end. Alright, and Marienburg and Ernanen. Pull him out. They're going to go meet up. We need to look out down there. Alright, better off getting rid of him. Even though we lose some troops. At least they're on opposite ends. So we'll just head up here. Take out the capital. Force a white piece. Called in Ernanen. Called a Raffer of Marion. Oh, Raffer of Marienburg. Really? Huh. Okay. Plot to kill Sviatoslava of Russian Revolt. No, um, yes, he's definitely staying in that one. Do you want to get a bit of a chance there? Alright, looks like a nice sized army. And she's stupid enough to stand there next to us. And spy... Oh, did he die? Inherited... Ah, oh, This dude with the painted eyes finally died. Alright, and taken over by his seven-year-old son... Air is some random commander. Um, this guy. We can demand he institutes gavel kind. Well, that's interesting. We'd like to do that to split them up. Demand that Vyarich institutes gavel kind succession law. Might refuse or ask something in return. Um, well, we need to do it now if we're going to do it at all. Hi, Chief Trafon II. Absolutely do that. Uh, not thrilled at instituting Gavakind. We'll surely comply in return for a large sum of money. I'm sure you understand. That's not a large sum of money. Alright, get up there. And Spymaster became available because he was the dude. So, appoint a loyalist if possible. We've got two to pick from, and this one isn't too bad. Grimmish 
with 13. Otherwise, she's, she's not that far down the list, really. All right. And she absolutely loves this, so that's all good. Um, sabotaging, building spinal work for plot power increase. Not worth it. Stoning technology, probably not. To get that plot discovery chance. All right, money and proselytizing in Smolensk is still old Slavic. Fabricating claims, no. So I'll just tune that chancellor's voting our way. Yep. All right, so that's given us two who are loyal. This advisor just doesn't like us enough. I could kick him out. Doesn't really have much going for him. All right, if we need to, we can replace him. And that is not right. All right, Khutia. Rodoslav is the leader for the center. One of these was a flanker. Movement speed and retreat. Defense. Must be the flankers that left. Foot with damage and defense. Alright, Rodoslav. And Vladislav, Rostislav. Katia is good with light foot and defense. Alright, go kill these guys. Hopefully, we get enough from this battle. That's only worth eight. Okay. Head up this way. Now, we're not suffering a penalty other than winter. Courtier is dead. One of the courtiers has been annoying my wife, Kusumba. What on earth was she thinking? Just opinion. Chief, whoever goes up. He is our steward, so yeah. Alright, shoot went okay. We're gonna stay here and siege these down. Okay, righteous imprisonment of a high chief. Small chance. No point in doing him. We've defeated way down there. Alright, as long as he keeps those guys away. Declared second to in revolt for Vyacheslav's claim on Vyavich. Which is good. He should be able to win it this time. Alright. In and Vyadic raising his troops. Uh, we're looking okay. We've got some cash, so back in Novgorod. Can afford the stables. Let's get some light cab. And we are still doing the thing over here, aren't we? Yep. Take some time. Defeat. Victory. Somebody's attacking us. Holy crap. Russian Revolt. Army of Armas. He's, or she's, used... I imagine she had a lot of prestige, because she wouldn't be able to use piety. Um, white piece is a no, but damn it. Yeah, you have already one. Power of the Council increases. There's no way that we can win it. So, we're going to have to give up. Um, yeah, we can't raise any troops at any way. Let's go and invite a disciple. Um, damn it, we're on 30%. If we could get out, which we can't, then we could have gone and siege something. If we try and drop them, we lose half our troops. No, we have to give up. Oh, that's annoying. Alright, we surrender. Congratulations, you dirty butch. Hopefully it's only revoke titles. I think they do two every time. Yep, imprisonment. Damn it. Welcome to my court. Alright, have a look at her in a minute. Um She's terrible. Alright, Eugenic. Eugenic Melusha. Well, it's still the thing. Alright. Uh, it would have been good. We got to kill her slightly earlier. Spared no time before they burned him at the stake. Curses. Hey, news from China. Intending to enforce the subjugation of the state of the Zhao Empire, the Chakra Western Protectorate declared war on somebody in India. May their gods protect them. 
and we've been revealed for that plot. Um, I think we do still want to kill her though. We'll die by poisoned wine, and these guys will come down to milk the herb. I think we just need a bigger retainer. It'd be a lot safer for us. Uh, let's worship the ancestors. Guide my sword in battle. Um, <laughs> retinues. Look at this lot. Heavy cav. Heavy cavalry, I think, would be good. We've seen how much damage cavalry can do to us. Heavy, ca heavy cavalry would have to be better. Heavy with light. Uses 900. Not quite be able to do it. Alright, time to present your offering. Do we want to become one-eyed? We're pretty old, so we're going to die soon anyway. Um, we don't want to die yet, though, because succession is not safe. Uh, ancestors, sure, be pleased with such a vigorous, vigorous servant. We got three loyal. Spymaster. Good. Um, concubines have to be given up. They're too old. Alright. Set her aside. Secretly convert to old Slavic. Yeah, interesting. Um, set this one aside. And our wife is young. But the concubines is anybody a genius? You're too old. And you're too old. And one of you is okay. You're right, religion. Take this concubine. Um, otherwise, intrigue. She the one that we just invited in. Cheers. All right, let's do without the intrigue then. Um, low intrigue, but high something else. All right. Instead, let's go. My religion. By age. Actually, uh, anybody lustful? Oh, look at this. Thirty-two, and a thirty-eight. And they're not really terrible. She's one-eyed. Interesting. So, take the concubine. No, because she's a claimant. Well, that's annoying. Alright, we can't get anybody lusty. Just take people young. Is claimant. Right, um... No claimant filter. I guess we're going to go for her. Infidels? You're my religion. Why would you not? What about you? Claimant, of course. Claimants, claimants, claimants. Dillo. No, the rest of them are too old. Can't even get anybody. Okay. Accept your suggestion to make us, give us the concubine. Okay, young lady, you need to have a baby. And we'll discover it again. That's going to get worse. Alright, arranged marriage. King of Pomerania wants to steal our niece. Uh, we say no. She's 35 and for some reason has never been married. Commander of Rus. Alright, similar party mercenaries will ambush her. Gain little golden diamonds. Alright, so success. And she was inherited by this girl. Her heir is who? Our kinswoman. Don't really want to be a kinslayer, so no, let's not uh, get caught doing that. Um, we need to go back to trying to kill this guy. 31%. That is terrible. Um, 
He's 56. There's got to be some way to get him to die. Actually, we could buy a favour and then force him to come. Let's see if that works. No, he'd need to... Yeah. Currently considering buy a favour. Alright. You, buddy, invite to court. Must not be married. Must not have a council position. When did he become a steward? Alright, well if this guy dies... Nope. Alright. And this guy might pass from our realm. That was the one that's not true. Alright. Our army is a decent size. Now, Romney has very few men over there. We declare for this be the conquest. He would call in Saraquinta. That is fine. Uh, we might be able to do this just for this army. Let's get them over there and in position. The daughter was born. She is supposed to gain his... That will be inherited. Alright, Chieftain of Arugan. Isn't much. Alright, they're getting in. Rumor has it they're influenced by his guardian Splendor. He's now considered properly Ilmenian. Who is his guardian? Designated regent and court tutor. She's pretty good. She's quick. Alright, um, who's our heir these days? Our daughter has become our heir. Yeah. Uh, inheritance. Everyone's going to vote for this guy. We've got to try and knock him out. And he is located over in Vladimir. So, he's got the spy network in Vladimir. Discourage from joining factions could be important. High Chief of Jaroslav for Rus is the strongest faction. Um, fabricate a claim on the Kingdom of Rus. Alright. So, ready to go on Romney. Uh, declare the war. Conquest. Send. Send these guys straight over. And we'll just raise our personal levy for this one. Oh, yes, of course. Forgot to look at that. That's the only one that he gets to raise, though. Alright, come back down to Novgorod, and that means we need to raise these guys. Romnians. And he gets across there before we can do anything. Well, in that case, do we want to try and pour our people into it? Possibly. Um, Roslav and Katira are in position anyway. Alright. Centre flanks versus centre flank. Somebody's got to arrive soon. A couple of days. Nice. Alright, demanding more money, of course. And that was worth 36. Good. So... Everybody, head up this way. Uh, he's going directly to Romney. And our stables is done. Alright, dirty secret. Just the other day, we were skulking. And caught Princess Sviatoslava in flagrante. Apparently not with her husband. Chief Puriata of Majaisk. Um, she's already got a bastard child. Forgive and forget. No, we smell profit. She doesn't have any money. We'll take it anyway. Oh, but he does have a little money. One ducat. And a daughter was born to Apad Apati. He has a strong claim on the Empire of Magyar that she'll inherit. Okay. So, in here, it's going to take a little bit of time. 
got no supply there, so we definitely need to assault this. Oh, good. So, give us your land, buddy. Offer peace, enforce mines, hand it over. And then we can stand them down. And we can stand them down. Looks good. Alright. Now, Romney will be part of uh, this region. Jamia. Yeah, so Pomoria. You, buddy. France, Romney, and 12 year old lacks a focus. Um, I always click the wrong one. Playful Idolizer. Let's go Intrigue. Okay, majority has been converted in Smolensk. Excellent. Proselytize in our brand new spot. Alright, Vassal Levy's raised too long, that's going away, and yes, dangerous factions again. Yaroslav for Rus. Um, this kid, if we were to arrange a betrothal to somebody very old, it won't work. Past childbearing age. Um, what about, it has to be close. Is our granddaughter. That's good enough. Obviously won't accept that, but uh, yeah, you're not allowed to do this, buddy. 101%. Formed an alliance. Accept the betrothal. Damn it, was it only with him, not with his liege? There. Oh, I accepted the peace offer. Oh, good for you. Accept it before you kick it off. Alright. That'll get him out. And we've got problems down here. Increase council power again. This triple chiefess needs to die. Alright, Refa of Marienburg. We shouldn't have given him that damn land. I don't get why he's allowed to raise such an army. Hmm, 26. Can we... All right, the other guy died. Um, you're our champion. There we go. Um, you're also master of the bow. And you're our cupbearer. So on 51. How do you feel about gifts? And other than that, you should be fine. And he's in both of these, which is good as well. Alright, the other one's gone. Independence faction. He's about to drop out. Not sure about the athleticism. We gain brawny. Alright, martial health there. It's going to be important for a while. Um, who are we trying to kill these days? Yaroslav of Vladimir. Extra 12%. Sounds good. We can do a few bribes here. Eight, seven, seven. Let's uh, bring them all in. Send gift, send gift, send the gift. Uh, how much is that worth? Just over a hundred. All right, that'll do. My chief Gleb has formed an alliance uh, with Chief No Guy. He could be dangerous. Glev, we know is dangerous. Alright. It's looking safe at the moment, though. So, the other problem... Was trying to get that whole thing done. Alright, Knut has inherited Marienburg from Refa. Seriously. Died of depression because he was given so many titles. And Knut... Can't raise much, so I guess we're a little safer there. Um, do have those titles back. Nobody's given to yet. We really need more concubines. Do, 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 do. I can't remember why we're we trying to kill him. 
disease the current air. Right, failure. So, with him gone, inheritance uh, should fall to whoever we've nominated. Which at the moment is that guy. By dynasty. How are we even voting for him? Um, yeah, everybody there is terrible. My concubine tells me she's pregnant. Uh, well, gonna say it's ours. Alright, child likes to focus. She looks intriguing. Haughty is bad. Alright, go for intrigue. And did these get split up? There was, um... Who is the guy? It's you. Luzro and Vyadic. You must have won the defensive war. Can it be the father? No, we trust her. Shakai has been converted. Well, it is a dangerous place. Plots are everywhere. Who is aspiring to kill our daughter, Gramislava? Who would dare? Nobody that we know. Damn. Suppose we send more troops. Yes, do so. Not that, that actually does it. Well, they are getting bigger, so maybe. All right, training grounds has been built by the Luki tribe. Hello, Luki tribe. You need to keep upgrading this training grounds. I think the levy size and garrison size. It's not huge here. Um, let's go with the war camp. And in Novgorod. Uh, what do we need? 170 odd. Need tech for them. Oh, we're going to do the Dragina. Actually, we're going to go for the keep next. So 200. Although, probably needs to do our uh, retainers. What are they called? Retinues. These guys, slightly too much. We need. Retinue cap increase. Can't do it from tech. I have to do it from holdings. Total 1472. 9. 1479. Oh. Alright. So we need two more holdings. Yeah. Alright. Um, some days I think I'm going insane. Awesome. Now, we'd like to do a quick war against Vlogda. Um, probably not move them over there. Important decision. Yes, we need the Durillo. And Marshall has become available because he died age 77. Uh, yeah, okay. We shall appoint. Mm, of course. Wow. Um... No, we'll try and get the vote some other way. Rostoslav, commander of Rus. Welcome to the council. You are training troops in Novgorod. Alright, Knut has declined. Vassals have arrived. He is to represent Jurillo. And celebration winds down. Alright, how are we looking here? He will raise 2,000 men. Mosses of food being picked clean. A daughter was born. Named Ulida. It's our third daughter. What is going on there? Okay, um, we do need to try and get another concubine. 16 year olds around the place. Um, probably needs to be my religion specifically. Take concubine and Gifa. Don't invite to court. Take concubine. No, because infidel. Um, yeah, it must just be the other guy's the infidel. She is shy. Anybody lustful? So nobody we can get. We'll have claims. Um, Ludmilla is too old. Asa, spy master Plock has a claim. Um, she is ugly. 
seriously, guy. Um, force conversion. Not even on the cards, because he's not under us. Alright, leave that as it is. Finished our worship. Good. We've become Paragon of Virtue. Wow, gained quite a bit off that. So, next up. To the realm Prosper, build a war chest, groom and air. We want to build a war chest. Alright, achievement unlocked. Paragon of Virtue. Fulfill the Paragon of Virtue ambition. Surprised I haven't actually done that before. It's not a great deal of uh, piety. Alright, get another concubine. Procured a poisonous viper to kill... Yes, him. Don't point that thing at me. Success. Awesome. So, I wonder who Mr. Slav, Yaroslav, and Gleb are going to work for now. Slip away into the night. We have a new heir. Play as Chief Kibrinia of Keramiza. Who's not terrible, but he's not very good. Well, that's a non-aggression pact. Uh, gone. Okay. Um, anybody better? Our nephew, or just whatever distant people these are. I think Volodar is going to come out better. So let's go back to being him. Alright. Well, that's sorted. And we are looking old, 53. But I'm going to take a short break here. So, thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. Let me know what you think in the comments, and I hope to see you again soon. See you later.